Good evening, everyone. I got another bank to show you here tonight. This is the Dennis Bank. It was designed by Charles Bailey and made by the J. E. Stevens Company. In order to operate, you place a coin in the left pocket here of the dentist. Then you press the lever, which is located right here at the feet. The dentist extracts the tooth right here and falls backwards. He'll fall backwards against the gas bag and the coin drops into the bag. At the same time, the patient right here will go flip over in his chair and throw up his arms. We'll see it right here. There you go. It's a very uh, rare bank. You won't see it uh, uh, very often uh, as an original. Most are recasts or reproductions. This is one of the few that is original. You can see here the various colors of the bank. You can see when he comes back, he throws his arms up in the air. I'll give you a couple different views of the of the uh, of the bank here. There you go, like right here. Let's see what else we have here. There you go. Let's see, this is called nitrous oxide uh, gas bag. And years ago, when they wanted to put the people to sleep, the, usually there was a pedal right here, and the dentist would pet tap the pedal at that. At the, at the same time, then the gas would come from the uh, gas bag that's sitting behind him, and get breathed in by the patient. And that would be how they would be anesthetized. Uh, it's a real fun bank. Uh, like I say, you won't find many available. The Dennis Bank, made by the J. E. Stevens Company, Cromwell, Connecticut.